a quick one. What about if a business owner promotes such influencers in a haram way? His money is haram. His income is haram. Because when I, yeah, I'm an influencer, by the way. I have 1.45 million, huh? 1.11, well, I don't know. <laughs> Who cares? Uh, a million followers. So come, I'll influence your business. <laughs> no, don't respect. I think we will close and we will run out of business. Why? My, we have to bring someone with the same voice. I can soften my voice. <laughs> I can apply hair gel on my beard. It looks nice, you know, if you wish. They choose what tackles desire. And they choose what sells. And shaitan is the one who's beautifying it. Fear Allah Azza wa Jal. If you want halal business, the risk comes from whom? Allah Azza wa Jal. So you seek what is in Allah's hands through what pleases Allah, not through the opposite. If you are with Allah, Allah will grant. But the problem is there is no iman. There is no strong conviction that Allah is the razzaq. This is why you depend on your wit and smartness and energy and knowledge and power. And this is when Allah leaves you alone. So you want, you want risk from haram ways? I'll give you. And it will grow. But there will not be barakah. Subhanallah. One shilling with barakah far exceeds a million without a barakah. And this is practiced by those who know what barakah is and Allah knows best.